an essential part of working with mindful communication with other people is that we create a green zone for ourselves. So the, the concept of green zone is really important because it's basically a place where we can discover what a projection is. Uh, it's very difficult to discover what a projection is if we don't have time to reflect. Um, and, and reflection needs a certain kind of protection circle or protection space. So part of why we're working so hard to create a community uh, online and in our travels around the country is um, because we really want people to, to have to combine personal uh, meditation and self-reflection with an opportunity to talk to other people. It's almost like um, an alternative to psychotherapy, uh, being able to just work with each other and explore some of the issues that come up. So having said that, the first thing we discover when we're working in the, in the privacy and the safety of our own meditation is that we begin to notice that um, we recognize our projections. So for instance, when I was falling down, um, when I look back on that, when I reflect back on that experience, I realized that I had a projection that was very self-critical. Like, you know, I was judging myself. And if, if somebody had not come toward me and said, can I help you with love and concern in its face, I might have spent the rest of the evening beating myself up for having been so, you know, clumsy. So where would I see that projection coming up? Um, if I sat down and did some loving kindness or compassion meditation, <clears throat> I would begin to, to notice that there's a voice in my own mind that enters in and is judgmental or cruel a voice that I, I would never have that response to someone else, why would I have that response to myself? So you understand other people's projections by understanding your own. And, and that's a really helpful and important piece because when we do talk about the red light, the most important thing is not to judge other people for their projections, but to have compassion for them. At the same time, it's really important for our own well-being that we recognize projections when they come up. So, you know, if somebody is accusing us or blaming us and wanting to hurt us, at that moment, it's really important for us to realize that their light is red. And when we know that the light is red, we know that there's only one thing we can do, and that is stop. <clears throat> 